hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is princess so today i want to share with you guys my covid19 experience <gasps> yeah so in august august like first week of august i can't actually remember the date so i got covid19 <laughs> so how it started i started sneezing having itching throat like my two eyes they are so red like itching me and the first person i called was my dad i was like dad this i explained my symptoms to him because he's a medical doctor I was like wow that's covid he was like I, he doesn't even know what to say but with all these symptoms it's like covid 19 he started questioning me where did i go to did i travel anywhere who are your friends who are you mingling with you know african parents or like that i don't go anywhere just to the mall and maybe sometimes to the park just to take a walk because i'm very careful and i'm always using my mask so i really don't know how i got it but so i was like okay just go and buy vitamin c 120 milligram i use one tablet per day get yourself a puniki thank god i have a puniki bamatum put it inside hot water cover yourself with towel and don't worry you're going to sneeze everything out so i did that i got vitamin c i boil hot water i put a puniki there cover myself with towel i was sneeze. like it was very very crazy when you cover yourself with towel and that steam that hot water steam like it actually burned but like it's so crazy so i did that my sister so she was aware she was like okay i should buy ginger with lemon so i buy ginger lemon i will drink it in the morning and night it actually work and ginger has high content of vitamin c so it helps me another thing is i got this tablet it's for pregnant women it's prenatal drugs and it's also good for lactating mothers so you can use it like everyday multivitamin so it contains biotin folic acid i was using this prenatal drugs and it also boosts my immune system like it really really helps me and it makes me eat very well at least in a day i'm eating like three four times per day so after using the drug maybe a few hours later i'll feel like eating so it's very good it helps me like i'll show you guys the packet but i showed them maybe already because i actually don't know how will be doing this video but i'll just like okay let me just share with you guys with you guys because some people believe covid is not real even i have people around me that believe it's not real my man is an example he believes it's not even like oh that virus just over a year it's just over hype it's not real blah 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 so when this stuff happened i was like man oh boy do you believe it's real now he was like yeah it's real and it's actually also infected and it was even more serious than me and what actually helped me during my own crisis was like i don't have temperature my temperature is still 36.5 but towards like all this thing lasted for like three weeks so towards the ending my temperature started rising to 37.5 and i started having difficulties in breathing i was just inside my house and i was telling everyone i'm sick i'm sick my few friends i know we are so close i used to go to their place i was i called them like you know it's so crazy <laughs> you just like you have hiv and when you want to tell someone that you have covid 19 like it's so weird just so i called her how are you feeling she was like she's feeling good everybody's fine okay i'm exposed exposed to what <laughs> okay i think i have covid 19 i got covid 19 like so scary but how you guys feel oh they are okay they are fine everybody's okay i'm fine so i just stay at home even some of my friends are like oh i want to come and visit you no 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 please just stay i'm not feeling okay so i just stay in my comfort zone for like three weeks or one month i not go anywhere and thank god for like this civilization you can order everything online so anything i want to eat anything mcdonald's i want to buy chicken anything i will just order it online and it's delivered to my doorstep so i don't go anywhere because it's even so embarrassing when you go to the mall and you're just sneezing because like every one minute i sneeze so you even feel like going out you even feel like going to your friend's house maybe now you you go and pay visit to your friend and you're sneezing like 10 times 20 times they'll just send you up like even their facial expression will be like oh my god what's this so you you know 
I don't even have the strength to even go out like I'm so weak, body pain, joint pain. So I just rest, just rest and Google is my friend. I'll just go to Google search how to how to cure COVID-19. And the funniest part like, there's no even care for it. So even if you go to hospital, they will just isolate you. They don't have anything to give to you. They just isolate to be checking your temperature, maybe your urine. So the best thing just to stay at home or if you know like okay this is not really worst like you can't you can't just it's worse so let's say your temperature raising to like 37 degree and you're having difficulties in breathing so that at that stage you have to go to hospital because at that moment you need ventilator to breathe i just thank god i don't have temperature my dad keep on asking me oh, what is your temperature oh, i'm checking my temperature morning and night is still 36.5 so i thank god and I don't have any difficulties in breathing on so maybe at the third week just three days I've got the breathing on my temperature was 37 degree and later everything is back to normal so now all this happened in August and now we are now in October this ending of October so I'm fine I'm healed no itching of the throat no burning of the eyes no EM no joint pain so I'm good so and because I just talk to myself if I don't stay in my comfort zone, if I don't stay at home and I set visit friends or something like that, or I want to infect my friend. When I'm ill, they'll still infect me back. So if you just got COVID-19, just stay at home. But if you still like, okay, you're having high temperature, you're having difficulties in breathing, maybe you're stolen, you're vomiting, just go straight to the hospital. You don't need to stay at home and kill yourself. But funny. Part, I don't I'm not having stolen I'm not having vomiting I'm not having diarrhea just the eyes my eyes my two eyes they were so painful they were ready they were itching me itching of the nose my throat they were so itching especially after sneezing it was really really so crazy like it was so crazy Adam I just been to God God please forgive me on my sin I cannot die now forgive me and I was so positive I don't even tell anybody nobody even knows the but I was so positive like I was really positive and I don't take it for any part and I was so strong so guys I was so positive and I did not allow it to bring me down like I was just praying to God like God I cannot die now. I have a lot of things to achieve. I'm not yet drive the Ferrari and the lamp. I have to drive Mercedes. I'm not yet like so it was so funny, but I just thank God like my baby was with me, my dad too was with me, my sister too, and maybe my few friends that they knew about it. So thank God. I beat COVID-19. I'm free now. <laughs> I'm so happy, like it's so crazy. It's actually real. Like, just be safe, just wash your hand daily. Like, every time, just wash your hand, be clean, be safe, wear your mask, and you're going to be fine. Don't panic, like, seriously, don't panic. Everything's going to be fine. Just, just rest and stay at home. That's all. And just use your vitamin. Just use all your vitamins, take your vitamins and up to now every day I'm even using vitamin C every day, every day, every day just to boost my immune. So that's just it I'm fine now. Okay, so guys, and another thing, COVID-19 is not a dead sentence. I know it has taken so many lives, thousands of lives have been lost during this pandemic so if you get it that's not the end of the world just relax your mind and you're surely going to beat it i promise you you are surely going to for me to beat covid surely it's you are going to so i'm fine now i'm good now i'm healthy and everything is fine so in my comment section let me let me know <laughs> any infection you've beaten before <laughs> Guys, I'm really so happy. I've beaten COVID-19. <laughs> so that's the end of my video. And let me know any infection you've beaten before. <laughs> so let me know any infection you've beaten before in the comment section. Any experience? Do you have COVID-19? How do you survive it? What are the stuff you use? How do you beat COVID-19? Just let me know in the comment section. And Please guys, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. Thank you so much. Bye.